I have a trio of stories here that quite frankly don't warrant making an entire video about just one of them, so I'll do them all together. Lord of the Rings, The Rings of Power Season 2 will have an all-female directing team. Yeah, you know, it's okay. It's going to be eight episodes. It's, it's, it's really hard to say what's going to happen with it because Season 1 did not go over anywhere near what they were hoping for. At least I would assume so. Unless they were crazy. You know. But some of this, I think, is to almost shield it in a way from, you know, criticisms and stuff. Because I've, I've sailed the high seas and watched some of the Rings of Power Season 1. I'll be honest, I haven't watched the entire thing because I just, it's not easy to get through. I don't know if I'll be able to watch the whole thing. I just, I didn't care for it. There's various reasons why we can go into that another time, but Season 2, they're gonna, you know, obviously they're, you can tell they're going to do it somewhat differently, but at the same time not. Because it's, it's, you know, I mean, it's, it's I don't want to say they're doubling down on stuff, but it's not, eh, you know, eh. I got a story here from The Verge. Netflix is making a live-action My Hero Academia film. Here's to hoping that it'll be better than Netflix's adaptations of Death Note and Cowboy Bebop. It won't. You pretty much guarantee that. And it goes on, and I'll, I'll link these all in the description box if you want to read this for yourself. I'm just going to quickly go over it. F filmmaker Shinsuke Sato will serve as director, while Obi-Wan Kenobi producer Joby Harold is penning the script. That, that really inspires confidence there. The Obi-Wan producer... But anyway, uh, if you don't know My Hero Academia, it takes place in a universe where the majority of humans are born with superpowers called quirks and centers around the once quirkless Izuku Meteora. You know, uh, basically, it goes on, there's more to it. You know, when Meteora is granted super strength from the hero he idolizes the most, Almighty is accepted into the prestigious UA High School for Heroes in Training. There, he meets other quirk wielding students while working towards unlocking his truth strength and coming face to face with powerful enemies. It's, it's a pretty good series. I mean, it, it, I, I know some people, some of my friends and stuff don't care for it. Other ones really like it. So it's it's kind of hit or miss. But anyway, and it says, you know, it's hard, hard to tell who's going to play the role and everything. And it goes on and talks about, uh, it's the, the, you know, the Netflix has got several other live action adaptations. It has plans, including One Piece, Avatar, The Last Airbender, Yu Yu Hakusho, and yet another Death Note. They got others as well, but it's hard to say which ones will actually come out. And they're all going to be garbage for the most part, pretty much. It's, it's just the way it is. But anyway, uh, here's something from Prime. Here's a tweet from Prime Video. God of War is coming. Prime Video orders a God of War series based on the critically acclaimed PlayStation video game franchise. This is terrible news as well. Now it's fully possible. I, I will give Amazon credit. Reacher and Jack Ryan. Those series have been good. But you know, Rings of Power. You no, know, I mean it, it's like enough said. You got other. You know, plus also it's like. Uh, I could just the way the games kind of went. Like I don't think Ragnarok was nearly as good as the original God of War the reboot or however you want to look at it. The 3D when it just came out on PlayStation 4 a couple years ago. It's uh, you know not not good. You know here <laughs> that was my reaction. But uh, here's reactions of other people. You know Tom Holland is Kratos, Mark Wahlberg is boy, so on and such forth. It's just you know, I'm, I'll go ahead and wrap this up here, though, but it just does not inspire, uh, it doesn't inspire me, you know, to think of greatness or whatever when it comes to Prime Video. Although, like I said, there are, you know, I mean, Jack Ryan, Reacher, I like those series. Those are good series. But anyway, eh, we'll see. I, I'll, I'll keep an open mind about it, but I ain't hopeful. Anyway, I'll go ahead and wrap this up here. Thank you very much for watching and have a good one.